Hi right, Steve, just to recap on yesterday's session, as we can see here on the top right, the ball has moved back in the stance and the hands are in front of the golf club. Unfortunately, it's a little bit excessive. What we want to see is a little bit more like we see down here on the bottom right. So the shaft is leaning towards the target. The handle is out in front of the club head, but not excessively. Your hand position is good, but unfortunately your ball position is too far back in this grid or circle that we've put down on the mat for you. Consequently, the club is coming a little bit more or a little bit too much from the inside. If we just play this through from down the line, you can see the shaft and club coming excessively from the inside, which means on the way through, you've got to rotate that club face. You can see there the toe end passing the heel on the way through, which if timed incorrectly, can lead to either a big miss to the right, if you keep the club face quiet because you're coming too much from the inside, club pointing to the right, or a pull to the left because at the last minute, at the moment of impact, you get the club face a little bit over rotated, that points left of your target, and that's where the golf ball is going to go. In regards to your overall positioning through the swing, that's improved dramatically, you can see now, because you are trying to keep the handle leading the club head to impact, your ability to maintain your angles through impact has improved tremendously. There is still a tendency to lift, but it's much less than it was. So the key thoughts for you from yesterday's session were to just move the ball fractionally forward in your stance so that it's just an inch or so ahead of the centre point in that grid. And what that's going to do is that's going to get the shaft leaning a little bit less towards the target as we see there on the bottom right and as a result should encourage you to trace this line coming into the ball rather than getting too much on the inside with the resulting need to over rotate the club face. Good luck with it and speak again in a couple of weeks time. Well done.